off screen, but we will have Charlie and Nitro on screen. I believe this is winner's finals, correct? Yes, yeah. winner's finals. So I imagine this is going to be Joker from Nitro. Yeah. Just because, uh, yeah, yeah, just because that, that Richter versus Wolf not, not looking like a hot match that you used that one for. Have I seen a, haven't seen a high level Wolf versus Joker matchup in a while. Feels like quite some time too, honestly, uh, just because the way that the meta has kind of shifted so good. A lot of the top players kind of just dropping him in general. Yeah. Like, I haven't seen Larry versus Leo, or like Leo versus Zachary's Wolf, so I, I don't know. I mean, Zachary still goes Wolf, but I feel like he might be able to just go a different character rather than. Ooh, Ooh I love the shiny extensions. I think fastball up air into shiny is like a combo at that percentage. It's kind of one of the only combos that kind of see Charlie kind of pull out. But who knows, man? In other regions, we might see, you know, Wolf and Joker a little more common. I don't know their stock taker in. Also. Yeah, yeah. There's a few decent wolves on the East Coast team. Right now, though, Charlie looking really strong in this matchup. I used literally just bullied Arsene away. Like, he didn't even run away from Arsene. He just hit him enough times where it was gone. Yeah, you have to be afraid to challenge Arsene to kind of respect him, but don't be afraid to hit him on either Arsene. You will lose the meter. Right. Alright, so really good. Something's up in the edge guard. What's the recovery plan here? Oh, oh no, he fell out! Yeah. Oh, they still bullied him in the corner, dude. Charlie's like, he's very good at just forcing his opponent to go exactly where he wants him to. It's yeah. like using his movement alone. Especially the dash stand is more prevalent in this game than ever. But I feel like dash dance is kind of replaced with perfect ability. Yeah. Oh! Oh, close, but no cigar, but the arson activated. Oh, all right. I, I like it from Charlie. Uh, Oh, okay, no. It's just, no. <laughs> I was like, he went there because, like I mentioned, uh, some of you guys may not know, you only get 24 frames for Wings of Rebellion. And if Charlie had dropped down the extra one in there, he probably would have clicked when it would have been enough. Yeah, I feel like even with Charlie dropping that stock, he hasn't actually lost the frames. Like, Fragile's been on the back foot this whole game so far. Yeah. <laughs> oh, barely spot dodged that. <laughs> Nice oh my Charlie's goodness, space Raw. Man. Raw Wolf Flash, man. He's not afraid, man. He, you have to respect Charlie at that point. He's kind of one of the only wolves I kind of see in Wolf It's Raw Wolf Flash. Or he has a lot of subs in Wolf Flash, too. Yeah. I mean, it's a really cool move. Like, it's very satisfying, man. And it kills at least. I, I wish more wolves found ways to make that happen. Make that move work, like a tournament. Yeah. Yeah. So far, man, uh, Charlie out here finding a good fight of a. Uh, Really great wolf deck, but anyways, the back of the game here, a couple back here, Charlie did not gonna drop the shield. I mean, I respect the blast. <laughs> no oh. oh no! And it looked like he might have been trying to probably parry that, but unfortunately he just dropped the opportunity. And that Arsene gets so much shield there. Still though, Charlie looking really strong in this dock. Nitro very close to dying. Oh. I like that he went for down so there, just needing to keep him on the leg. Yeah. Oh, trying to bait him out to do like a spot dodge there. Still grabbing him. Technically, nope, doesn't give attack. Charlie was looking for something that he was like easier to punish, but still the up smash, catching that whiff grab, I think, from Nitro. Yeah, whiff grab, yeah. indeed. Okay. Yeah. Here for Charlie. This is kind of what I expected to see from this wolf. Really clean, great combos. Not really doing predictable, like, Defensive options. I wonder if uh, Nitro might be thinking of a character switch. Uh, probably, you know what? It would be tough too because I feel like the Belmonts do kind of struggle against Wolf otherwise. Yeah, the, the reflector is too good. Yeah, it, it's it's really too good, and also just Wolf's damage at close range against the Belmonts is not going to be really good for them. So yeah. I feel like it's still something that Nitro kind of has to stick to Joker and see how it all plays out from there. Yeah. Yeah, he, I mean, at this point, he should just, like, try to play better at the matchup. Like, figure out how Charlie's playing. It's not like he's playing a bad character whatsoever. Joker has no. the tools to beat almost every character in the game. Yeah. I mean, he is the best character in the game, currently. I'm just going to wish I mean, I don't want, I don't want someone to tell me, like, no, man, it's actually, it's going to be Tal, you know, what that means. Please, man. 
Uh, I'm sorry. I, I just report him as I see him, and the score list says it's Joker. I think he's the best, but not by a super big. No, not at all, not at all. Oh. I thought that would be a much harder punch for Nitro when he would miss that wolf fire, like directly above his head. Nice going for Nair, gonna cover in the roll, get a bit of control. Also, I Ooh. like the way he tries to set himself up for back here, and even though Charlie went for Wolf Fire, he was still there. Yeah, he kind of like faked him out. He didn't immediately sweep the back there. So Charlie did like a weird up the angle, and then just caught him. Uh, hit for doing that. Yeah, now a lot of luck closer here in the next game with the forward throw since Charlie up for a back here at 10. And that's kind of different too, because with Nitro, he would have been expecting a, a board tilt yeah. or a down smash, but now Charlie just mixes it up at the right opportunity. Yeah, good mix up there for Charlie. <laughs> It's kind of the tree of watching Troy. It's his mix up and his combo game is definitely almost almost like a nun in the best. Yeah, I think so too. I think Charlie's only big weakness as a player is like a lot of players. It's like he has a poor mentality sometimes. Yeah, yeah, most Holds definitely. But once he gets over it, man, he plays on his game. Last year here. Nice, Charlie kind of took center stage away from Nitro, gets the parry and a punish here. Up throw to the up air, putting Arsen on the activation. Last year to force Nitro to go low. Uh, no one can move here. Yep, yeah. and he re grabbed the ledge. Unfortunately. I think he, uh, he got cheeky with that up air through the ledge, and like, I don't know if he meant to re grab there, but yeah, Charlie just took a full advantage. Yeah. That sucks because Nitro had a pretty decent move. And even then, too, the way Charlie had set up Blaster for Nitro, just kind of having a low recovery. Wolf Fire was still evenly able to survive. I like the shield. Uh, I'm sorry, the grab out of shield, but you have to understand, out of shield options like grab aren't the best in this game. So Charlie wanted to cover Lucha get up. I would have preferred to have seen Nair. Yeah. Oh, fighting his way out off the ledge with the forward air. Charlie, he sees that he's a feel like Hilberson, he doesn't have a huge lead, so he's trying to build him as best he can while also playing very safe. Yeah. And it's working out pretty well for him so far. Oh, but there's our sin. Everything will kill right now. Charlie literally can't get touched by any, like, straight hit. But there's me up there. Pump the jump immediately. And, uh, yeah, Charlie's going to weigh out the meter just a little bit. Hang on the bigger platform. He's no more visibility, but still. Drain that RC meter as best you can. It's definitely worth the long run. Okay. Down air, oh. nice. It's the up tilt. I oh my goodness, that's so much insane. He just took so much reward off of that little RC he had left. Okay. Call me crazy, man, but sometimes I feel like Wolf just has the best spot out of the game. Uh, I, I don't know. I, I don't see how it's any different from everyone else's spot dodge. Ooh. Ooh, food for that. Man. Hey man, we'll get back to it, don't worry. I feel like spot dodge cancel the wolf is probably the best one. Yeah, you can probably like, spot dodge cancel like up to or F to. Leading really fast. Ooh. Scary. I mean, most spot dodge is all good. But like I said, food for thought, man. We'll come back to it eventually. Wait a minute. Charlie's activated. Be 136. No oh. back air. Charlie making sure he's avoiding it as much as possible. That's going to be a back throw and the edge guard here for Nitro. Charlie is spanking. Oh, the jump, but unfortunately, so the fact that. Oh my god, the Tetra card and hitbox is insane, dude. He like actually went really low to like not get hit by that, but it goes. It, it's like it sucks it up into the like strong hit. That's piracy, dog. I'm sorry, that is piracy. That's DLC, baby. Pay money for that. We pay money. For we that we pay we pay money for that counter. Damn, that's crazy, bro. Nitro saving that for like the last game of game two. That's rough. And it's also because Wolf Fire also has like that big hitbox right before it grabs the ledge too as well. Yeah. Three, two. One, go. Yeah, he like reversed that situation on Charlie. Because normally that up hits through the, through the ledge and like catch people, but he's got countered for it. All right, let's see though. One one between these two. Nitro figuring out a little bit of uh, how Charlie's playing. But overall, I think Charlie uh, isn't doing bad at all. Just needs to clutch on these kills. Yeah. Almost to the back air, missed opportunity, but still close. The threat is always moving Ooh. for Nitro, but he, the one time I, I see Nitro, I actually look up attack to challenge Charlie's, Charlie's down smash. Up throw, nice oh, to the back air, not but true, though. So that was true. That's what Mark Joker, Joker should do. They know their opponent's combo is like not guaranteed. Keep that free meter. Tech chase here. 
Yep, good for Charlie. Even though it doesn't kill, we'll send him off the stage. Charlie's edge guard opportunity, looking for this other option to sign from down smash to grab. But down there to out smash will bring Nitro to the stock lead at 105. That's one, of, that's one of Joker's like, most insanely uh, good combos. Yeah. Good dash attack to kind of cash the landing here from the, the game. Man, that's the second give attack that Nitro's done, by the way. Charlie trying to make these spot dodge cancel tilts work to get this dock, but Nitro's not getting hit by any of them. Yeah. All right, guys. I will update you guys with the score. Oh, has double eliminated. K9 and has double eliminated K9. I repeat once more here. HLB has double eliminated K9. And point, I'll say that in. I don't want to give you guys like a bias. I'm just letting everybody know who's wondering what happened to the losing match there. But let's jump right back into it here. Uh, Nitro tries to go with take aim after the jump too as well. Man, Nitro is so good at playing defensive Joker. <laughs> like, I feel like, you know what it's crazy? I feel like it kind of comes, it stems back from him being a Sonic made in Smash 4. Yeah. Where he was really good at being aggressive, but also really great at being defensive. Like, this is, looks very frustrating for Charlie, I'll be honest. He took like 101% for mostly just tick damage. And and even then too, that was really good for Charlie to go for that empty hop, to go for that opportunity because he kind of like changed up against Nitro. I feel like where he's winning more victories against Nitro is his mix-ups. Nice, goes across the stage here, wants that full cross-up. Oh, not safe for B, but oh, oh man, I thought that falling up there was going to lead to down here. I'm pretty sure that works. That other looked like he had enough hits on this combo. Alright, Wait, hold up, hold up. Oh. No, no two frame. Man, I thought Charlie was going to actually go off stage since uh, B has no box. Oh, close. I like the shield Wait. stand up too from Charlie. He doesn't want to commit to something hard and get punished. It would be really big for Charlie if he got this stock before Nitro. He was so far he behind. He set himself up too far enough to smash, but Nitro kind of cut off the start up. Wait. Nice, jumps away. Oh, Whoa. I like the up tilt attempt there, but the back throw won't actually yeah. do it. At 155 at the left. Yeah. Oh, footstool. Yeah, that footstool got him out of trouble really, really well. He would have gotten back here for sure. Oh, nice. He might be going for the phantom footstool. I didn't even watch that video yet. <laughs> I just know the Twitter is up and about it. Oh, I saw it, the concept of it. I we can talk about that later, don't worry about it. 141 here to, ni uh, to Nitro. Charlie had one stock had to a piece, man, but it's only climbing higher. The deficit yeah. has changed. Dude, when Nitro's in the lead, he's just like, all right, bro, deal with these guns. I'm just going to circle cap you over and over. And like all the trades are in his favor, too. So he's not even in a bad spot whatsoever. Oh, oh my nice. god. The guns actually blocked him for a little bit. Back throw, that'll do yeah. it. Joker's weight is not that heavy, and of course, he even comes out of state close enough. Still, big uh, lead already. Yeah, big oh lead indeed, it's climbing he's harder. He's shooting him up. Oh yeah, no. the Compton shootout, man. <laughs> <laughs> the Compton shootout, man, you can't even punch the ground. Charlie's trying to make some start here with this Bobersang string, though. No tech chase. We need to follow that tech roll if we want to continue the damage, but... Four throw, once yeah. again. Nice, I like the angle from Charlie. He doesn't want to go that extra low. Oh, wait. oh, missed back air, but the up throw here, looking to see how he's going to react. I All think right, that's why Charlie's going to go for back air the last time, because he knows it's not true, and Nitro caught him out of the last yeah. one. Oh, my goodness. Charlie, not only does he have to take this dog, he just has to live long enough to get rid of our save. Oh, close, but oh, yes, again, the same move here. He pulled out the last second here. The that touch of ground hitbox is disgusting, dude. It doesn't even matter what part of it, what part of the legends you recover to. It just covers so many options, so it works up to you. Especially the hitbox literally just scoops them up. Yeah. I don't know, man. Uh, thanks to change in 2020. Soccer. 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 Yeah. <laughs> thanks to change in 2020, man. Soccer, I take I notes. I feel like that's the one thing that, well, down gun's kind of ridiculous, too. Which one? Down gun is actually pretty ridiculous. I think it's fine. I would prefer to just nerf back air a little bit and catch a car and counter. No, just those two. I, I think that'd be fine. I don't want I don't want Joker enough to nerf the ground at all. I, I think the character will be viable. I'm really more interested in character bumps. But hey, man, we'll Ooh. see. Oh my god. Damn. 
No per se taken. <laughs> Charlie, uh... He has a message to send. Charlie wants this game five, for sure. But, um... Yeah, I was just saying. Yeah, I think Joker's a, he's a really cool character. He's really fun to play. But, like, yeah, just some things that he can do is just like, dang, that's that's kind of crazy. But, yeah. damn, Charlie's doing some crazy shit right now. Like, that, oh, that stream was so good. Yeah, that was really good, too, because he also said that you go up low and try to go for a two frame over two, which Charlie loves to do. But Nigel can just run back to with Aegon, forcing oh, yeah. Charlie off the ledge here. Yeah, Charlie's putting on tons of pressure right now. He's not even trying to let Nigel set up. Yeah. Play as, like, I love it. And I love it too because he's setting him up to go low, but like I said, Nitro's not letting Charlie have that as easy as he wants it to. Oh. Down smash, full charge, chooses the wrong setup option. Oh, the, the Nair sent him far off. Can you go for another one? Oh, it's oh. really too late. Yeah, too late. The Nair would have been it, but it's not enough. Oh, it's good, man. Nitro thought he had an opportunity to get a, a hit, but Charlie just saw right through that. And I don't know, like, I don't know if you got the first three uh, stock was elegant earlier, but uh, I don't see Charlie getting three stock at all. Or yeah. sorry, reverse three stock at all. I, I think I think Charlie has enough to bring this to game five right now. Yeah. Uh, weigh out the meter as long as he can. Again, stay on the game for five and, and I feel like that's what some players fail to do a lot is weigh out the meter. Yeah. I mean, I would do it just just because like you have all that time when you're invincible. Yeah, and when you have a two stock lead, yeah. it's really worth going for. It. Oh my god, the multi hit of the down air, even though Charlie takes the first. Oh! oh. Uh, did he go for Wolf Flash? I, I feel like he went for Fire. Whatever it was, that Arsene down air completely obliterated, but nice. Forward Smash. Nice. Looking for a, I'm looking for a 2 fight this time, he's going for an aerial. No, good take away from Charlie to avoid that dash attack. The meter, though, is still relatively healthy for the Nitro right now. Uh oh. Good snipe. Hold up. Good, yeah, Watch, yeah, okay. Good angle from Charlie to stall as best he can. Oh, nice. my God. Nice, changing it up here. Doesn't want to get hit by the Tetrakarn. Yeah, he almost died to a Tetrakarn uh, counter at ledge almost, like another time. Look, Harry to forward tilt. Charlie looking to close the stock here by Nitro. At 109 at the ledge. It's looking like it was going to be Charlie's possibility. Still bringing him out here towards oh. the corner here, but Nitro switches things up. Oh. Take aim, get the second and the tenth hit. Not just yet, Charlie's still surviving. Yeah, Nitro's brought this back. In spite of all odds, I didn't believe that he could uh, make such a huge comeback, but I shouldn't have stepped on him, I guess. He had no more invisibility, but he didn't do anything. Charlie didn't go for the, the wing blow, but wow. Oh, yeah. MT okay. hop up to call him dropping shield. Charlie bringing it to game five just barely, even though he had such a strong lead. Yeah, Nitro's a, man, Nitro's a joker is no joke, man. Well, yeah. No, no pun intended. <laughs> no pun intended. But. If you guys are wondering uh, what's going on in the background, of course, this is the last WNF before we go on Christmas break. So we had an ugly sweater contest, and uh, yeah. It's really cool. I like the Cloud Nine one. The Cloud Nine Christmas sweater looks cool. Yeah. I'm, I'm some actually, of these ugly sweaters ain't that ugly, man. They actually kind of style. Yeah. What the heck? Like, you see Tia? She has that Overwatch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Tia's is pretty sick. <laughs> People making sure they're out here with drip and their husband's sweater. That's, that's what it's all about. I should have brought mine. Mine has a, mine has a, it has light up Christmas tree lights on it. Did you see some of these? Remember the ugly sweaters inside, doesn't it? Yeah, <laughs> I, I almost got one. Oh, man, that was a little too pricey. <laughs> yeah, I, I ain't paying it like I'm 70 bucks for an ugly sweater. You're gonna wear like once a year, right? Yeah. Anyway, game five between these two. Winner goes to grand finals. They've both been adapting each other really hard. I mean, at this point, I kind of respect Charlie kind of saving the down smashes too, because if he goes for it every single time, you can see that Nitro can actually go ahead and go for get up attack. But also, he wants to make sure if he sets up down smash, he wants Nitro to be forced to go for a roll. Yeah. Oh, that was close. I like the fact that he kind of pulled in for the board smash, and we even saw the startup frames, but hey, hey how will take care of that. The game in again. It's giving Charlie trouble to land here. You're being lit up by the gun. I'm telling you, man. Luckily, Magic's not killing him. Sorry. Oh, never mind. All right. I mean, in the real company, shoot him, man. People out here dying, but. In this one, Charlie's surviving. 
back throw. Yeah, Charlie with stage control here. And I like the fact, even though he doesn't go for an aerial, his ability to jump out of the stage and jump back in lets Nitro know, okay, I have to be careful how I'm landing. I don't want to get hit by an arrow back air. Oh, no roll. Charlie was expecting a panic roll from Nitro. He's not giving it to him. And you already saw. I, I can't hear myself talk. <laughs> I can't hear myself talk. They're going, too, they're going too crazy in the background. I'll tell you, man. I'll just win our giveaways. Anyway. Close game right now. Nitro is super good at playing keep away. Yes. And I feel like that's frustrating Charlie a little bit. Especially because Charlie knows he can get so much reward. He gets the right hit. But it's just not falling into place for him right now. Steam straight hits. Not really leading to the combos. Opportunity though. Oh. Yeah, close one, but not eight. Oh, yeah, but he missed two of them. I can't believe that force match missed. That was like just barely out of his time. Yeah. Okay. Nitro trying to hold on to Larson, but it's gone now. Hey, Charlie has the opportunity to play a little bit more aggressive since he doesn't have to worry about dying to Arsene anytime soon. Okay. Uh, I was going to say, that might be a down throw there, but he goes for up throw, trying to change things up against Nitro. Yeah. And it's really good for Charlie because he mixes up his throws. Sometimes he'll go for down throw, up throw, forward throw, and that kind of mixes up the DI against Nitro. Oh, back air. Deep uh, back air. Caught Charlie on the sleep, sleep at the wheel, man. And now Charlie again is the one that has to take the stock, make a comeback happen. There's the up smash though. This time he's gonna shield the get up attack. Knowing that Nitro's been going for that pretty often. Now it's an even game basically. Is that what you want to get the start here? Oh nice. no, and he's a little low well here. This still gives Charlie the stage control, but he missed an edge guard opportunity. Yeah. I felt like what he wanted to do was go for like an empty hop to an air. Alright, he's probably waiting out the yard safe, playing it smart. Knows that he has the lead, and it's Nitro who's forced to approach. Nitro just out, throwing out these guns, trying to make something happen, but yeah, Charlie hanging back really tells you here. No, he did, he did get the knockdown. Yeah, so he no, did. No down smash. Ooh, back air. No sweet spot. No recovery. Really. Can he get the two friend here? Looking for the get up. I like the up smash attempt here. Yeah, I also like how Nitro's getting out of the corner with guns. Yeah. It's so safe. But. Caught the roll, and Charlie will move on to winner's side grand finals in a super hard third win over Nitro. Yep. Great stuff for both.